What's up guys? This video is sponsored by Canon, which is something I'm just so excited to say because honestly, Canon is like one of my favorite brands. All of my videos are filmed with their cameras, just in case you were wondering. Literally love them. So I'm super, super excited for this. It's something I've been waiting for a long time for. And today I am going to be using this. It is called the Content Creator Kit. Can we just look at this box, please? Look at how cool this is. It just like kind of wraps the whole thing together when it's packaged cutely. So let's get started. Okay, so I've been super, super excited about um, this kit that I have today. First of all, we have a bunch of cameras at my house, but the ones that I normally use to film these videos, they're kind of like a small like vlog camera. We have two of them. Literally, we're filming so much that all the time, constantly, we have like no cameras to film with. So I'm super excited that I have one that I can like say is mine. <laughs> Nobody else can film with this one, I guess. Also, I just like this one so much because it comes with like everything. It has like everything from start to finish that a like creator would need. First, thing that I'm seeing in this box, the tripod. So it's called a tripod grip. Literally, you guys, you should see what I'm filming on right now. This is my tripod currently. It is a box of wipes, so I could definitely use this. And this one has a lot of like really cool features that I'm super excited about with this camera. So this is the tripod grip that comes in this whole creator kit, and I will get this set up in a second. All right, continuing on in the box. Oh, comes with an SD card. Very handy. The 32 gigabyte memory card. You basically just have to buy this kit and then you can start filming stuff and taking pictures. Okay, then we have the camera itself. The EOS M200. This is the camera that I'm super, super excited about. I've heard of really great things about and I'm so excited to test this. This is Camry's face when she's excited. I don't know why I'm talking like this. I just can't focus on anything but this camera. Okay, so of course in the box with the camera, you have all the instructions and stuff. Next strap, that for your camera. You have the battery charger in the battery pack. Super important. You can't really use your camera without these, so you can make sure I don't lose these. <laughs> okay, here is the camera itself. It's so clean. So nice. The last thing that I have in here is, of course, the lens. And this is the EFM 15 to 45 millimeter lens. So this will connect straight to the camera. Yes. I'm gonna put this all together now. I'm super excited to uh, just try everything all together. It's all right here. Okay, I have set the whole camera up with what I do with all my pictures and videos. It is so, so, so important that I have like high, high, high quality content, just good quality cameras that take good quality pictures. And this camera is definitely one of those that does that. It's so small and super lightweight. I love the mirrorless cameras because they're so much lighter than the other ones so I can like carry them around with me. It's just so crazy that a camera this small has such good quality stuff. It records in 24.1 megapixels and shoots in all like 4K video, which is super, super nice. One of the things that I like the most about it is this tripod grip mixed with this remote control. I think this is super cool. Most of the time, since the twins moved out, I don't have anybody to like take my picture at home anymore, but this makes things so much easier because I can just take pictures of myself using the remote control and the tripod. I can just set it up. Look at this, check this out. It's taking pictures of me. I'm not even touching it. It is time to actually start this challenge. But the thing is, because of all this stuff with current events, so I can't really leave the house. So I can't really do like a normal photography challenge, I guess you could say. We're going completely different with this one because A, I'm going to be the photographer and the model, and B, it's going to be in my house. So this can be super cool, super different. I'm super excited about it. Let's see what I can get with this awesome camera. I do something with this. This is so difficult. I've never just like set like pictures up like this before. I don't really know how to do it. Gonna look, look at my face. See how big my eye is? Is it like massive? Yeah. It looks so weird. I have to get my eye to look, it can't look creepy. That's the bad thing. You know, this is how Paige Armenta does it. Did really? you know that? Yeah. I think some of hers are a photographer though. They are a lot of them, but a lot of them, I see her and her friend push a yeah, remote button. She uses, and then she uses Canon too. And I could, cause I can see her camera. Her camera is Canon, but she has the app connected to her phone. And she presses a and, remote button like that. And cause the app, you can like control the settings on the camera too. Yeah. And she can see the picture. It's but really cool. With the remote. Like I'm literally like, but, I need that at home. I just set up the whole, like I have a Canon, but I don't have a remote and I need dude, it. This remote is nice. Look at this. I can just. You wanna know when this would've been useful? When Bailey and me and Brooklyn were filming a video like two days ago and the camera stopped recording. Yeah, that would've been useful. <laughs> and we missed like 12 minutes of footage because we didn't realize it stopped recording because we couldn't get up and see it. Can use this now. Um, but yeah, no, I've seen Paige use it because she has the remote in her hand and then she like hides it. So she'll be, she'll like do it and then she'll be like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, Cameron's decided to stand on the chair. <laughs> we'll see uh, how this goes. We're getting creative here. It just is like, it's just me on the chair though. Maybe it'll look cool if I'm on the desk. So, yeah, get on the desk. Okay, I gotta move the chair back. <laughs> like, look at me. Throw the papers when I tell you to. Press the button and throw the papers when I tell you. Okay. Ready? Go. Kind of, yeah. Kind of, we, I think we got it, actually. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this is my current setup for the next one. I'm planning on using these, these markers and that tape to kind of like tape coloredness over the lens, if that makes any sense. But I think it'll be like a really cool kind of like natural effect. So I'm really excited about it. Let's get started. So something I really love about this camera and the tripod in general is that it does shoot vertically. You can see, I tilted it vertically. And I love that because I shoot all my footage vertically, pretty much all of it. It just transfers over to other platforms better, like Instagram, like if you're filming videos. I'm using this, I'm probably gonna use vertical for the rest of the video just because I like vertical photos better. I'm excited about how these turned out. Okay, so I changed <laughs> my clothes to look a little bit more like pajamas, and I'm gonna do a really cool shot like in my bed, and I just currently like totally tore apart my room to make this tripod here, so. If it looks like my room is a mess, that is why I promise it was just clean. Let's go. Okay, so officially, this is super hard. <laughs> I don't know how people take a whole bunch of self-portraits because it is so difficult to get good ones. It's more just like, like the camera stuff is really easy and like I figured out how to use this remote and it's super nice. I actually just figured out on this last location that there's a little button thing that you can do on the side and you can change it from like taking the picture immediately to taking it in 10 seconds. And that helped a lot on this one because then I could have some time to kind of like hide the remote. Look, she's changed. I changed. New outfit, who she? So overall, like in general, tripod with the camera has been super nice. I think we've all kind of, everybody that has seen me take pictures with this so far in the house is like, we're gonna use that a lot because we always are filming by ourselves, so this is super nice. Yes, ma'am. You know, this is not very comfortable. I can't really see anything, it's too sunny. When did it suddenly get so warm outside? <laughs> not sure. We're trying to attempt to take pictures in the flowers. I'm gonna get so muddy. Oh my. Now move your muddy hand. Don't worry guys, don't worry. She's on the dead flowers oh right there. <sighs> Mud. Mud. Ooh. Cute look. Good accessory. Mm. Sometimes um, standing just in front of a window can let a lot of natural light in. And it's super cool to play with in photos, especially if you have a curtain or something like that. Just play with that contrast. So that's what I'm going to be doing in this kind of setup. I moved upstairs one more time. Oh, my final shot, I wanted to try some photos in the dark. So I have my flashlight right here and I'm going to be using that just to get some cool reflections, especially with these glasses. So let's see what I can get.
Wow, I do have to say, wow, I'm like blinded from the light from turning that on. The low light settings on this camera are really good. Like, I'm just even looking at the, cam the photos now that I just took on this camera. I'm really impressed with it from just having like, using a, like a little, the flashlight. There's a lot of light coming um, in the camera and I'm super impressed with the pictures from that shoot. So, wow, these are some good pictures. Hope y'all enjoyed um, watching this video of me being the photographer and the model for this photo challenge. But really the creator kit made it so much easier just with the tripod and the remote. I mean, and the flip out screen helped so much because I could see what I was taking as I was taking it. But really taking pictures of yourself is really hard. I think I'm happy with the pictures I took in this video though. Hopefully y'all enjoyed watching this video. Thank you so much for watching it and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.